It doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? It's coming up next, live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina up against Portugal. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And the contest begins. Guerrero. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Well, it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group. They had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2020. And danger still! A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. It's a short one. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, in every football generation, there's a player who stands above the immortals, and Lionel Messi falls in that category. Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique, and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. And a throw-in for Argentina. And support available. Perfect tackle. Bernardo Silva. Ronaldo. And reading it absolutely superbly. 
Messi. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Now can they make something happen? Jota. Ronaldo! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Elects to go short. Good strength to keep the ball. Jota. And back with Bruno Fernandes. Oh, yes! First to score in this final. And it could be highly significant. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. A lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo. Now, uh, what can he do from this excellent position? Able to get a body in the way. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to their lead. And there's the delivery. Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Rodrigo de Paul. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. That is that for the first half here. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Room to manoeuvre on the wing, but they took care of the situation defensively. Lionel Messi. It's with Joao Cancelo. Pepe. Joao Cancelo almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Fernandes. Here's Ronaldo. And the pass, a good one. Bruno Fernandes. Now with Cancelo. Return to Ronaldo. And an attempt best forgotten, I think.
Bruno Fernandes. Now, who can he play it to? Ronaldo! It's still alive. But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Here it is now, a substitution. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Cristiano Ronaldo. And fine work by Argentina to recover possession. De Paul, Martinez, a quarter of an hour remaining here, Ruben Neves, could play it in, committed challenge, can he put it away? Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Dybala. De Paul. Martinez. Could cross it in here. Martinez. On to Paredes. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Ronaldo, well, that pass easy on the eye, Ronaldo, Leal, and the keeper there to deal with it. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Short corner routine. Leal. A really top-notch piece of defending. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions. And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them.